Yeah, probably for the best that we got those uses up for the no boss fight. No Oh, Pierce, you to death now. Over. Go, Go Chipo! Sharing is caring! Bob Pierce, I'm gonna start. By my hand. Elemental Mastery! Some power hits. I'll protect you! Okay, something died. Go! Symphony of Spirits! Take this! Tidal wave! Right. Windblade! Farewell! Symphony of Spirits! Tidal wave! Take this! Ow! Hard to break Symphony the head! Symphony of Spirits! Tidal wave! Right. Windblade! Farewell! An impressive display of skill. Anything for a lovely lady such as yourself. <laughs> An impressive display of flattery as well. Anything for a lovely lady such as yourself. <laughs> oh, Rowan. Should probably grab the, the bags and stuff as well just to be safe. Oh yeah. Need it. I don't know. Oh, oh there it is. Alright. Perfect. Fantastic. Do we still have any um food to use up? Yes, one more. Ah, I turned. Symphony no breaks. Right. You're weak too. Not bad. Fantastic. Oh, wow. And finished. That wasn't too bad. Just keeps getting better. Ooh, all right. Now we go back to Fenmont. Now we go back to Fenmont. Right. Uh, medical school, right? Uh, yes, medical school. Student services. And medical Eastern. school is gonna be uh, up there north. Yeah. Go north. Oh, look, a med student running. Kill him. <laughs> it's probably not a good idea. Why, hey Jude, is that your school? Yeah, it is. I mean, it was. I doubt they consider me a student anymore. Uh, in there? No, I just wanted the dialogue to finish. Gotcha. So, uh, it should be in, like, the southeast corner of here somewhere? Southeast. Oh. It might be in the hospital. In the hospital area? Ah, uh, let me see. I can work my weight. Yeah, this is like back where Jude's classroom was at the beginning of the game. Hmm. I think. Could have been. Yeah, we're at reception. We need to get to student services. Well, I can't go that way. No. Bring up the bring up the map for a sec. Where are we? With the arrow there, right? Oh yes, yeah. Okay, it's gonna be the other the the building to the south thing. Oh, it's the other building. Yeah. Okay. <coughs> uh, I was on the same same area. Oh. Okay. That goes out to Ar Arkland Crag. We don't need to go there. Okay, I know. Hang on left once you get in here. To wait. Oh. Keep going that way. Yep. There we go. Okay. There's student services. Southeast. You. Ah. All right, I'm in the middle of working on my graduate thesis, but I don't have the materials I need to complete my experiments. 
I know this is a long shot, but I don't suppose you could help with that, could you? Thank you. All I need is some monster fluid. With that, I'll be able to prove a new hypothesis I have about manilobes. Please, do your best. My life is riding on this. Conveniently for you, we just happen to have some monster fluid. Just don't ask what kind of fluid. Yup, that's the monster fluid I need. I should be able to finish my thesis with this. Now, just between you and me, if I can pull this off, I'll get to be the lead assistant to House's replacement. Once that happens, I'll be set for life. Seriously, thank you. Okay, and now... Now we go to Sherilton. Oh. <laughs> to the to the manor. Think. Okay. Talk to Drissel, I guess. Uh, probably. I don't know who else is here. Yes, Drissel. Uh, Drissel, where are room. you? But notice that you appear to be a bit flushed. I hope you haven't caught a fever. I have caught a fever. A fever born from great passion. Oh boy. I was so moved by the poetry you wrote in Mad Screams of Love. Ah. Uh, what? You don't mean... You were the one who bought that book? Yes. I must have read it aloud dozens of times. Aloud? The passion you exude in your screaming about love and pain is just incredible. I, uh, I was quite young back then, and, well... We need to republish this and make it available for all the world to read. No, please, anything but that. Are you sure? I am quite adamant. Then, would you at least do me the honor of signing my copy? Only if you promise to never read it aloud again. Very well, it will be our little secret. Apart from all the people that I already read it aloud to. That already heard it. <laughs> oh god. Alright, sweet. Anyway, back to the research center in Fenmont. Uh, okay, to the research center then. Uh, yeah, right here. What do we got here? Oh. Are yeah. you okay? Is he breathing? Mr. Eldon? What? Doc. Dr. Jude? Lie still. You're hurt pretty badly. Uh, Mr. Uh, Eldon was the like guy that doc. Jude was like doing doctory stuff on way back at the beginning of the game, uh, and then it costed us at the port when we were trying to leave. Oh, okay. She tricked us. One of the researchers was actually an Ajul spy. When I tried to arrest her, she blew up the entire testing chamber. We'll carry oh. the wounded to the hospital. Come with me. Is it safe to move his neck? Oh, well. It, it sounds okay. like Gaius is making his move. We can't waste any more time. Yep, All right. better not help these people. And we go. go inside. All the way up the stairs. Oh. Oh. I'm hungry, and if you don't eat a lot, you'll never grow bazoongas. Not that one. Not that one. All the way up the stairs. Okay. I'll Which just have to do with the incredibly round, oh, um, incredibly roundabout way. I guess we need to. Oh, wait. Are we in sector three? No, we're only in sector two, aren't we? This is sector. Yeah, three. Yeah, we need to get to sector three first. Ah, okay. That's why. Now what? 
Doesn't sound like knocking will get us in. The Lantern Presnick is just beyond this door. There's got to be another way in. Let's look for it. Okay, now we have to go all the way up the stairs, presumably. Okay. Up, and I think that's where we found red. What was that? Sound of metal grinding? I don't know. What is the sound of that? What? You okay? Uh, yeah. I don't know anything. I'm sorry. Isn't she... It's the mayor! Hang in there! The mayor of Hamil? They did say that the Rashigal army invaded the village. Ah, all the villagers froze and solid. No! No! Hey, come back to us. Don't give up. <coughs> oh no! Mayor! Oh. Asked it's Professor Revive? House all over again. Uh, wait, did but she... she didn't dissolve. Did she? She's not there. The villagers were frozen solid. What could that mean? Someone with ice magic attacked, or or an Dean? I don't know. Is this what Gaius's henchwoman meant when she said the power of a great spirit? This woman was knocking on death's door. She might have been delusional. Either way, this is unforgivable. I wonder if it'll work the same. Yeah, we did a thing up there, didn't we? We did. <sighs> Are you thinking about the mayor? Mm -hmm. I understand how you feel. My teacher at school was killed by that same awful machine. It's not that. It's oh. that I'm not actually sad at all. Well, yeah, they were kind of abusive to you. Is Elise a heartless monster? Elise. Do you think she got what she deserved? Of course not. The mayor suffered horribly. What happened was so awful. Would a heartless monster get so mad about what happened to the mayor? Would she shed tears over it? No, I guess not. We have to destroy that stupid lance. Okay. Fiddle around with these things. Can this contraption help us? It Define might let us look help. in on the lance. Here's the video feed. That's remarkable, Jude. There's nothing there. Oh, they moved it? Uh huh? The Lance of Kresnik is gone. Did that explosion destroy it? <laughs> Surely it would leave some wreckage behind. Yeah. Perhaps the Lance was moved before the explosion occurred. That's the only logical explanation. But moved to where? Anywhere he wants to attack <laughs> from. Or to Palace, possibly? Mila, oh. look! I found a recording of what happened. Is that the spy Mr. Eldon talked about? That girl. She's the one from our last visit. The red one? You're right. She was the one that attacked us. Hey, what she got there? It looks like someone discovered her ruse, so she detonated a bomb. But isn't she a Najul spy? If I were in her shoes, I wouldn't risk my life like that even if my cover was blown. In the game of espionage, a dead body can still provide valuable intel. Right. Then how about this? Maybe she planned to blow up the lance all along, and Mr. Eldon finding her was just a coincidence. If Jude's theory is true, then it's likely that the girl didn't know the lance had left the facility. 
That means she's now either on her way to the location where the lance was taken, or trying to find out where that location is. In either case, we might find out something if we can catch her. According to the timestamp on the mm. video, the explosion only happened half an hour ago. Then she's probably still in the city. Yeah, seems likely. We need to find that girl. Okay. So, teleport out of here? Back out to the trading post. In the direction of the trading post, at any rate. <clears throat> oh. Kid. Getting pretty hungry huh? here. How oh. long has it been okay, since shoot. I've had one of Mom's home cooked meals? Dude, stop. You went to medical school here, didn't you? Uh, young students burning with passion, living their dreams. I bet you miss those days. Not really. We studied and trained all day, every day. I never did anything particularly memorable. Right. Lame. That is so you. Even those days of toil will one day be treasures to you. Yes. I would have liked to have gone to school myself. You should have. Maybe you'd have learned how to behave like a normal person. Did you go to school, Leia? Sure did. I was the class vice president. How? Oh, then going to school doesn't seem to help Ow. your behavior at all. Oh. <laughs> you might be right about that. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Into the trading post? Hmm. Yeah, I guess. Oh, well, let's see. Then it was next to the trading post. Oh. It's two, huh? Nope. Uh, hmm. Hmm, indeed. Oh, shiny thing. $100, not exactly what we were after, but, you know. I'll take it. Not gonna complain too much. Huh. Oh. Oh, oh. Ah. Yeah. There we go. There she is. Oh, yeah, the girl in red. I know you. Do you? Yes, yes, yes! <laughs> I finally get to finish you off! And it's not even my birthday. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt your little psychotic episode, but we really need to ask you something. <laughs> Why would I answer you, Claude? Wait, I have seen you before. 